Good morning, Citizen Venture. Welcome to the neighborhood. Pack your bags, White. We're going to New York City. If I do this, the New York chapter will put its full support behind the new guild. That's the deal. Brock! Agent Brock Sampson reporting for duty. I'm stuck being the slumlord king of Craphole County. My enemy's basking in his ivory f***ing tower! <laughs> Yeah, but there's, there's love and there's friendship and uh, the failure of love and friendship and sure. I don't know if it has a theme or ever had a theme more than life. I mean, that really is what it's always been. Where the hell is Triana? Where's Triana? <laughs> right. We gotta talk about love. You know, like that was failure. just that was a that was a crush from his childhood. Yeah. There's no love there. I mean, so, it. it, it it would, it would have been nice to get some like some fevered hand job to put a nail in that <laughs> coffin. So you would have to like think about it. But I, I, I wonder if it'll be anything more than. That's true. When you were in college, did you still talk to like the cute girl who lived three doors down from you? Like no. Yeah, no. You, uh, you moved on. Because the show's about life. I, I agree with that. I'm thinking more about. I just love the idea that. Uh, the other girl whose name I don't know wanted to like become a villain and I always just wanted to see what happened. Kim. Like I can see her like an intern. No one will ever forget her. Dr. Mrs. The Monarch having like a little <laughs> intern and she's like trying to yeah. learn how to be a villainess. Right, like, it's, right. Just it's she was an attractive character. She is a female in an otherwise female list universe that we've created. Right. So you kinda cling on to that. She got uh, approval from Hank Dean, and Dr. Dr. Girlfriend. Girlfriend and Triana, so she has this pedigree right. and she was yeah. I don't know why she became, for years, we heard so much about Boy, and she this spoke character. her intent out loud. She's like, I'm gonna become a super villain. So everybody's exactly. like, all right, all right. Yeah. we're gonna develop that When's story, When's that gonna right? happen? No. no, we're gonna develop the story of the two snipers from opposite sides. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're more we're gonna end the season on that yeah. cliffhanger. Yeah. More important. <laughs> it's true. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> well, when you set something up of I'm going to be blank, then yeah. it, you can write that one in your head. You don't need us anymore. Yeah. <laughs> um, the Gargantua 2 kind of movie, which basically, in my opinion, like tied up everything from all the prior seasons. Yep. And then the yep. was so refreshing and such a whole new different place. I mean, like, is it going to be really, you know, you've introduced so many new concepts with the, uh, oh, what's the whale guy? The king? White whale. Well. White whale. Well. And I just love how you match everything. But are we going to see more of you know new villains and new kind of characters just on that vein and just exploration of I think kind for of success? For season, uh, kind of yeah. season seven, what, what we really needed to do and what you could tell just by watching six was we got to deal with the fact that the monarch has been the blue morpho for a long time. Right. So that's yeah, we have to wrap the that first up. thing we need to do <laughs> is to like just figure out where that is going. And that's that's the only thing we can tell you as a spoiler of is we will. Follow that through line. Yeah, we'll yeah. get that. We'll get that funneled into a smaller area and and figure out what comes out of the tube of toothpaste. That's yeah. a like a mixed metaphor that doesn't make any sense because yeah. <laughs> I had a funnel and then I decided at the end toothpaste. Oh, you have to really put toothpaste in through a funnel. I would feel like. Yeah, in my head I was thinking, and the toothpaste that comes out is peanut butter, and we can put it on a cracker and feed it to America. <laughs> that was all happening in my head. I thought that would that's like space food. Uh, Rusty, he experienced success to a degree in New York. Rusty, yeah, yeah. Rusty well, got got paid. You know what I mean? It's like yeah. I don't think he, he had any success. Like somebody yeah, died. Yeah, winning the lottery success. Yeah, he, yeah. he no, he, it's just it's it's winning. Yeah. He's got a winning attitude. <laughs> what? Yeah, it. She came but right now we're we're, we're yeah, dealing. If it makes her happy. Season seven is dealing with the idea that that success is not all what it seems. Also, right. this is gonna be another like. Short season as well. Or? I'm really sorry, guys. We have to uh, ten that. episodes. Uh, just, that's what we get now. That's how it works. Yeah. Yeah. If we don't one, one, throw, throw a special out and call it a double <laughs> episode. Please. Emergency. Into the panic room, everybody. I will subdue the intruders. You're dancing with the fallen archer now, big man. All gone. Shut the moon. Welcome to hell. Who are you? My dick. I am Think Tank. Prepare for battle, Venture! Dr. Venture, I come for your soul! Uh, 
Welcome to New York.